Coming to you live from the Beverly Hills Fire Department. Good morning, Dixon's Fire Tech 101 class. My name is Jonathan Boscarino, and today I'll be representing to you the Beverly Hills Fire Department. In this segment, I will be expanding on the details of the city and the department as well. The city of Beverly Hills is located off the 405 between Westwood to the west, West Hollywood to the east, the Los Angeles community of Beverlywood to the south, and the Santa Monica Mountains to the north. This city was originally incorporated in the 1900s as a retreat for the affluent residents of the Los Angeles communities. Beverly Hills is known for its celebrity residence and its high quality shopping off Rodeo Drive. The Beverly Hills Fire Department houses 81 active duty personnel. The head of the fire department's operations is the fire chief, Timothy Scranton. Deputy chief of department is Chief Embry. A typical work week for the Beverly Hills fire personnel is a 48 Kelly schedule, meaning 48 hours on, then 96 hours off. The Beverly Hills Fire Department runs mutual aid with LA County and LA City. The Beverly Hills Fire Department was established in 1913 as an ISO Class 1 department. It protects approximately 34,000 residents and covers about 5.4 square miles. This department runs out of three stations, Station 1, the Beverly, F Beverly Hills Headquarters, Station 2, and Station 3. The Beverly Hills Fire Department responds to nearly 3,000 calls annually, 80% of which are medical. The Beverly Hills Fire Department staffs its apparatuses daily. This department runs 22 total apparatus, including support vehicles. Out of three stations, Beverly Hill runs three frontline engines, two frontline paramedic squads, one frontline BLS rescue, one frontline truck, one USAR, and one battalion SUV. However, this department does staff its reserve vehicles as well. Those consist of three reserve engines, three utility trucks, three civilian vehicles, one RA, and one battalion. Stay tuned for a closer look to the Beverly Hills Fire Department apparatus. The Beverly Hills Fire Department runs three Type 1 frontline engines, each staffed with five fire personnel. These engines are compressed air foam engines, meaning they can carry 500 gallons of water and 50 gallons of foam concentrate. Beverly Hills Fire Department staffs one truck with five fire personnel. The truck company is stationed at Station 1 headquarters. The truck is equipped with 108 feet of ladder, a 100 foot tiller ladder, as well as tools used for extrication and ventilation. The battalion chief mans this vehicle. It is located out of Station 1 headquarters. The battalion chief is called out to any major incident or when a first alarm is dispatched. The back of this SUV folds out with radios, computers, charts, and demographics of the city or building. It is used as a mobile command unit. Beverly Hills Fire Department has three medical units, 801, the BLS module, Rescue 1, and Rescue 3, paramedically staffed modules. These squads allow for the transfer of a patient with ALS care without the need for the BLS ambulance. The fire department utility vehicles are used by fire prevention personnel. All of these vehicles are located at headquarters and are often used as commuter cars by chief officers. The USAR apparatus is used by Beverly Hills in the case of a natural disaster. USAR involves the location, extrication, and initial medical stabilization of victims trapped in confined space. USAR-1 is located at Station 1. Well, there you have it folks, the BHFD apparatus in a nutshell. But before we go, I'd like to share with you a few fun facts. Did you know on September 11th, 2011, the 10 year anniversary of the attacks on the World Trade Center, the city of Beverly Hills actually acquired an artifact from Ground Zero, a piece of structural steel which once served as a support beam for the towers themselves. This steel artifact is now a central feature of the Memorial Garden in the Beverly Hills Fire Civic Center, located right out of Station 1 headquarters. Let's go take a look at the Memorial Center now. As with so many historic events in our nation's great history, the tragic events that took place in our country on September 11, 2001, make it a day we shall never forget. 
and on September 11, 2011, Beverly Hills marked the 10th anniversary of those horrific events by unveiling the Beverly Hills 9-11 Memorial Garden. This awe-inspiring garden honors all those who were lost, those devoted to keeping America safe, and those who still believe in the created equal and have the right to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Alright guys, thanks for tuning in. This has been John Boscarino reporting to you on the Beverly Hills Fire Department. From Dixon's Class Fire Tech 101 2011, where the give a damn meter is always this high.